we, uh, we are privileged to be here uh, promoting Miguel Cotto's last fight um, here at the Garden, uh, December 2nd. Uh, I'm, sure, uh, I'm sure tickets will, uh, uh, will be going fast. Uh, they are on sale um, today. This is such a classic event. Uh, as one star says goodbye and another uh, looks to try to fill the void that will be left. What can you say about Miguel Cotto that hasn't already been said? Um, two decades in boxing. He is a first uh, ballot Hall of Famer, like I said. He's a true legend uh, in Puerto Rico, New York, and beyond. Um, um, so I'm very happy to announce that, um, that for every, every ticket that is, uh, that is bought, um, a portion of those ticket sales will go to various uh, charities uh, that Miguel Cotto and his promotional company will, will choose, so, um, which will help uh, spearhead relief uh, to the island. So we're very, uh, we're, very, uh, you know, we're very happy that Miguel Cotto can obviously uh, find it in his heart to, uh, to continue and always give back in, in, in any way possible. So thank you very much, uh, Miguel. I'm going to L.A., tonight to start my training camp. I'm going to do my best with Freddy, as always, and I'll be back in November here to face Saddam on December 2nd. And I know that he's going to do his best at his camp. I'm going to do his, the, my best at my camp, and we are going to bring a good show here on December 2nd. Thank you. I know I'm the underdog, and I know a lot of the media are, are throwing bad words on me, but um, if you work hard, you put your mind to it, and you come at your best, you never know what's going to come. And I like my coach was saying, it's not about the money. Uh, it's about the opportunity. It's about being a star. And um, I know 